Someone asks, what do I do or how do I download a video from YouTube if, for example, I want to share it through DVD or CD or some other means instead of telling someone to go to the YouTube website to watch it? YouTube has a little bit of a limitation, and I'm sure it will become even more limited as time goes on. The first thing I would encourage you to do is click on the Watch in High Quality link right here, right below the, the video on the bottom right hand side. Now this may move around but look for high quality. This may or may not be a service that stays long term but I think as they compete with higher quality video service providers YouTube will increasingly work to add as Google tends to do services that compete with people who offer new and interesting things people like and high quality is definitely one of those things. Because of the need or the desire for higher quality videos other companies have gotten into this space. Viddler is a company that I use, VIDDLER.com, if you haven't heard of them before. And Viddler offers a download feature. If you'll notice, you can click right here to download this, and you can download the Flash version of the video or the original. If you click on the original and it's working, a link will pop up on your screen. You can download the original file. And in my case, this is, you can see down there at the very bottom, this is an AVI that I uploaded right from the camera. That's a really cool thing to do, and if this is the video you're looking for, which was the lady who messaged me, the uh, flood in Coleman, Alabama, then all you have to do is just click on download this and download the original AVI, which will play on most Windows computers. However, for those of you that are looking for a video that's only available on YouTube, there are other options. There are the Firefox add-ons. Simply go search in the Firefox add-ons available at addons.mozilla.org or just Google Firefox add-ons type in what you're looking for which is a video downloader and you'll have a myriad of options pop up Magic's video downloader, Ant.com toolbar, Tube downloader, Media Converter etc etc and I'm using one already you'll see right here I have an icon the download helper that's the one I've chosen to use. It's pretty straightforward. It works most of the time. And I don't have to go to someone else's website to download it. Some of these you have to go to their website and look for, you know, through a pitch, a request for revenue or a request that you buy a product every time you download something. I don't care for that. So I went and I downloaded the video download helper. And I, I, right now it looks like this one's not in this immediate list. If I mod modify my search to just video download, it's on that first page, just a few down, called Video Download Helper. And you'll notice there's been 1.1 million weekly downloads and 1,136 reviews, and it has a pretty good ranking, five stars. That's what I'm using. I'm not sure I'd give it five stars, but it's definitely worth trying. If you'll notice I'm back here on YouTube's website, you see this little booger right there it's scrolling around? That means it's active. If you click on the arrow, you'll see I can download the floodwaters in Coleman and the high quality floodwaters in Coleman. So if I click on this, it gives me an option to download it immediately and there's the FLV file. Now you'll need a player that will view flash files. VLC Media Player from v, uh, Video Land, the VLC Media Player, just search for that and you'll find a link to it in your favorite search engine. This is a free product, it's open source, I'm not very concerned about viruses or trojans or spyware or what have you in it and that's because it's open source. Once I download the file all I have to do is click on media, open file, go to my desktop where I happen to have saved it, double click on the file and it'll play it. And there it is. It plays the file that I've downloaded from YouTube. Now what if for some reason I don't use Firefox, I prefer Internet Explorer, or I can't install Firefox, I can't imagine why you would not be able to install Firefox and then would be allowed to install an add-on from Explorer, but there are extensions for Internet Explorer. All you really need to do is go in and type in download video on the website and you'll see some options. And you'll see immediately there's YouTube Downloader which only has three stars. You might want to go through a few more and see if you find something that has a little more favorable 
response like here's five stars for the download extension it's only had two reviews uh, one of those is in Russian and one of those I don't know about so I'm a little concerned about it um, let's go ahead and install it and see what happens so I've installed the tool and I'm back at the same YouTube video I want to download flash video downloader and it's going to pop up a screen with a little bit of advertising in it. And we can click on this right here. And let's see. It looks like it's going to give us the MP4, the original file that I uploaded. So we'll try that out, see what happens. Now it's going to call it, looks like it's going to call it uh, video.mp4. So obviously you're going to have to rename that immediately if you want to have a clue what you just downloaded. That's a YouTube thing, not this add-on's fault. Back in VLC player, let's look at media, open file, we're going to go back to the desktop which is where we stored that file, there's the video.mp4 file, plays perfectly fine, looks quality, looks good, the sound sounds good. So although I don't necessarily endorse this extension for, for Internet Explorer, it does seem to do the job. I don't really like the addy part of it, I understand they need revenues, but quite frankly if you're going to advertise to me or harass me, I'd just assume you offer to sell me the product or make it an open source project and get other people to help you with it. Or, you know, maybe one link back to the author would be fine as well. So there you have it. You have a way to either download directly from Vidler or download the flash file from YouTube. Um, and again, you know, I would encourage you to click on the watch in high quality to get the option of downloading the high quality video although it appears to be available in the Firefox extension either way.